What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Lou back in the room. My team video today's my team video is on the maxed out two Galaxy Opal Jerry Stackhouse that got an actual update today and is now an Evo. And basically, all you have to do to Evo him is make 23 pointers and make 20 dunks, and you get all his upgrades. So basically, he gets a plus three to his driving layup, a plus five to his three point shot, a, a plus six to his ball handle. He can rebound a little bit, um, comes with an 89 interior D. A 95 perimeter defense, so he is going to be able to lock down people with a 95 lateral quickness. An 84 block and a 94 pass perception with a 95 steal, an 87 strength. Also gets his uh, badges upgraded. He gets brick wall, gold, he didn't have it. Um, ankle breaker, hyperdrive clamps, and quick chain all go to Hall of Fame. He also gets post lockdown, gold, but he didn't have it. He goes lucky 7 Hall of Fame, which he didn't even have it. Blinders go to Hall of Fame. Circus 3s go to Hall of Fame. Limitless Spot Up go to Hall of Fame. Chef goes to Hall of Fame, which he didn't have. Giant Slayer goes to Gold. Rhythm Shooter goes to Hall of Fame. Ball Handles for Days. Like, you guys see the badges, man. Like, the card is looking, like, pretty damn good. And he also gets the behind the back of Scottie Pippen. So, I mean, the card is looking all right. And let's evil him up real quick. And I don't know why I backed out, but let's evil his ass up real quick. I wonder if he turns into a Dark Matter. He does turn into a Dark Matter, in fact. So Jerry Stackhouse is 6'6", 6 6, 218 pounds from North Carolina. He comes with a 99 three ball because I have a shoe on him, a 99 mid-range, a 99 driving dunk, a 92 ball handle with an 88 pass IQ, a 74 pass accuracy with a 99 steal, a 84 block, a 95 perimeter defense, an 89 interior, 82 offensive end, an 84 defensive rebound with a 96 speed, 94 speed with ball, 96 acceleration, a 97 vert, 91 strength, uh, 98 stamina, 96 hustle, and a 95 lateral quickness. His tendencies should be pretty good if I remember right. Um, they are right. He comes with an 85 pass interception tendency, a 30 on ball steal tendency, which is atrociously bad. He comes with an 80 shot and 80 shot block tendencies. And he also comes with 33 Hall of Fame badges, catch and shoot, corner specialist, difficult shots, realist finisher, acrobat, ankle breaker, hyper drive, chase down artist, clams, quick chain, interceptor, posterizer, all ball pests. Pogo Sticks, Tireless Defender, Lucky 7, Blinder, Circus 3s, Limitless Spot of Chef, Rhythm Shooter, Slither Finisher, Downhill, Handles for Days, Quick First Step, Clutch Shooter, Dead Eye, Sniper, Unstrippable, Limitless Takeoff, Volume Shooter, Fast Twitch, and Menace, All Hall of Fame, while also having 28 Gold Badges, Tear Dropper, Brick Wall, Break Starter, Lob City Finisher, Glue Hands, Pickpocket, Pick Dodger, Intimidator, Rebound Chaser, Post Lockdown, Giant Slayer, Pro Touch, Bailout, Needle Threader, Set Shooter, Stop and Go, Tight Handles, Unpluckable, Green Machine, Hot Zone Hunter, Bullet Passer, Special Delivery, Ankle Braces, Grace Under Pressure, Slippery Off Ball, Triple Threat Juke, Ball Stripper, and Hustler, man. So the card's looking pretty damn good, especially after the upgrades. And now we're in freestyle testing as animations and everything, and then we're going to go on to a Triple Threat Online game after we test them out. So basically, his jump shot actually uh, became on very quick after the upgrade. And I mean, his jump shot is still on the slower end, even though it's on very quick. Um, but it's still a pretty good damn jump shot, as long as you can get it off over a defender and stuff like that. But the jump shot is cash. You're not going to have, like, too many problems with that. He has Scottie Pippen behind the back now. He's going to be able to dunk on everybody. He comes with a 99 driving dunk. Like, this card is not getting stopped when it's full head of steam like Giannis going down the lane, man. He just straight up isn't going to get stopped. You're just going to catch a body or you're going to get blocked. Which is technically means that you're going to get stopped. But you guys get the point, man. It's going to be hard to stop. But the jump shot is cash. His handles actually don't feel that bad except for his in between the legs. Because this right here is not going to cut it. And I'm not even good at ball handling. Um, and this is just atrociously bad. This right here. Um, let's check out his step back. Green. I mean, he has Hall of Fame Circus 3s and Chef. So, I mean, this card is going to be a beast. His leaner is all right. It's not like something crazy. Let's shoot another one. Maybe I, I got a bad animation. Nah, it's just on the slower end. That's all it is. It's on the slower end. But the biggest part about this card is that he gets hyperdrive and all those badges, defensive badges, all Hall of Fame. And we got to see how his defense is online and see if he, honestly, if he's even worth upgrading completely. Um, but yeah, man, we're going to give him one more shot and we're going to go on to a triple throw online game. Not waste your time. Okay, we're wasting your time because I'm not green. There it is. And so we found a game. Let's see how uh, Jerry actually performs man it's, he has a bucks jersey on i don't understand why i still have these on the jordan pulls on him and right now we are struggling we need to call quick iso so everybody just moves out of our way i mean where are you going my boy where are you going i'm hitting with a reversal i'm hitting with a reversal and he actually blocked that we're already here in the corner don't worry about it ellen houston got that if you're asking why i'm using ellen houston is because he's got an evil uh today too so just in case i need to kick it out there's no way you think you're taking that in i will say he feels extremely slow for having a 96 speed I will say that off the rip. 
I mean, that's a wide open shot. That's cash. It has to be cash. Let's go, man. Let's go. I, I, I want to see his defense be good, man. I really do. Because that's what's going to make or break this card, his defense. We're going to let the computer handle it. Get that out of here. I mean, that's a good start. I actually want to see if I can catch a body with him this game as uh, Tyler is guarding Moses Malone. Hell no, if you thought you were going to make that. We're playing off ball. Allen Houston, you got that unlocked, my boy? Yes, sir. No, that's off. That's off. Easy rebound for Tyler. I mean, this is going to be easy dunk. Easy dunk. I'm not worried about it. Easy dunk. I mean, he has a 99 driving dunk. You're not stopping him in the paint. You're simply not. We're already here. We helped out. We helped out. I don't understand why I just let him have a three. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Let's call a quick ISO. Everybody get out of my way. His handles do feel a little bit lackluster for having Hyperdrive Hall of Fame. I will say that. I mean, Jordan Poole is doing... <laughs> He's nowhere to be found, man. He's nowhere to be found. As we literally just crossed him with the simplest crossover in the world. Hell no, we're there. Nope, nope. That is terrible. And I mean terrible offense by him. He's going to go for the crossover to the right. We're already waiting right here. Hell no. Nah. Come on, 2K. Don't let him make that. Like, I'm clearly there where my defender is. I'm not. I mean, this is wide open. If, dude, Allen Houston, he just get the hell out of my way, man. He really does. We're going to kick it out to the corner. Because the computer's going to help. I mean, that's cash. Like, you can't leave this man open for a split second. I mean, actually, he technically can because his jump shot is extremely slow, in my opinion. Even though it says it's on very quick, but it doesn't feel like it's on very quick at all. Which I don't understand why it's not, but, I mean, it is what it is. We're locking up right now. Malka Bridges, I don't know what he's doing right now, but we're already here. Hell no. Give me the block. We got to get that block. We got to get that block, Tyler. Come on. 10-10 right now. We just got to get this dub. And Oh, yeah. Where are you going? Where are you going, my boy? He got a sharp badge. I was about to say, no matter what, it should be slightly green. Come on, man. So the card definitely feels pretty damn good. I wouldn't say like he's a top dark banner in the game or top card in the game. To be completely honest, just because his handles feel a little bit lackluster, his shot is extremely slow in my opinion uh, compared to other shooting guards like Clay Thompson and stuff like that. But it kind of that's what it feels like. It feels like Clay Thompson's jumper. That's basically what it feels like. There's no way you're stopping me in the paint. Like you gotta stop me at the perimeter. Or you don't stop me at all. And it, there's no way you think you're taking that off. Yeah, I, I was like, oh, what the, what the, is he saying, man? Wide open, green bean. Not worried about it. Green bean. Yes, sir. Like, we straight up murdered this kid. But, I mean, I just don't like his jump shot. That's the one thing I don't like in that little in-between the leg stuff. Uh, Handles-wise, I didn't like. I like Scotty Pippen behind the back. That definitely helps him. Um, but other than that, like, I really don't like him. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. I don't. Let's collapse. No. Hell, though. Oh, this should be an easy, easy, I mean, an easy crossover into a three. Thank you. Come again. Game over. Like, it's just that simple, man. I'm on the edge of if it's worth it or not. If you like his jump shot, then, I mean, I guess you. it's a good card, but I just think it's extremely slow, in my opinion. Um, Handles-wise, even with Hall of Fame uh, Hyperdrive, I really don't think his handles are pretty good. Maybe he feels better on next gen. I am on current gen, so you got to keep that in mind. You got to test him out if you really, uh want to use him on next gen but i don't know if i like him or not his jump side is a little bit slow his handles feel a little bit ass i'm not gonna lie um but the card feels pretty damn good defensively um and yeah man you guys take that how you want um i definitely think he's on the edge let me actually look up how much he's going for just to see if he was worth it or not the only reason i wouldn't say he's worth it the only way he's worth it if you already had the card and you just i mean it's a free dark matter if you just upgrade at the end of the day but i wouldn't spend sixty thousand basically on this card just to get a few extra hall of fame badges and him to feel extremely the same to be completely honest with you guys so i wouldn't say he's worth it. let me know if you guys have a different opinion on the card if you like the card um anything about the card you guys want me to know to see if i can like use it a little bit better and yeah it's been your boy lou hopefully you enjoyed and we out to stand peace